Hey everyone, it's David, and today's topic is distractions. So I think we're getting our attention stolen every single day. I think there's thieves of our attention. Just people, things, platforms, applications, TVs are all trying to steal our attention. And these thieves are intentionally trying to steal our attention so that we don't focus on the things that we need to focus on. And when I when I see this in my life personally, what it tells me is that there's value, a lot of value in focus. There's a lot of value in focus. What I mean by that is there's a lot of opportunity when you can focus on something. And so because the world knows that, they try to distract you. It's the hardest thing to stay focused on something today. But once you do, what happens? You get a lot more done. You feel more accomplished. How many times have you gotten through a day so focused that when you finish the day, you're like, God, that was such a great day. I feel so good about it. You know, maybe you're tired, maybe you're beat up, but you feel like you accomplished so much. Well, those were days where you freed your mind of those distractions. You cleared the clutter, if you will, in your world. And many people go through life not seeing that. And because of that, well, they get swallowed, if you will, by the world. See, I believe that many people aren't successful because they can't stay focused. They focus too much on everything else and not themselves. Right? They put more attention on the things that are going on outside of them than inside of them. They start thinking about what show comes on at 7 tonight, right? So they don't so that they can't miss it, so they can't go to the gym. They start thinking about what specials are going on at the nearest restaurant. They start thinking about what new show to be binging on Saturday, but they forget that those things don't produce any real result in their lives. And because of that, they're really just distractions. See, if you worked out, if you went for a run, that's a very good focused energy. And the reason it is, is because it produces a result, a good result for you. You see, the goal isn't to, the objective in life isn't to relax, to chill, to rest. You don't make the objective, the goal to relax and to rest. See, that is a necessity. So you rest, you relax, you chill when you need to, absolutely need to. And some people think they need to do that all day, every day. And that in itself becomes a problem. So how do you free yourself of distractions? Every time somebody grabs your attention, every time somebody asks you a question, and you know what, you gotta be real intentional about this because maybe inherently you don't even know that you're being distracted, but you have to make a a, a line in the stand and say, okay, is this helping me or get hurting me? Is this getting me farther or behind? Is this an asset or a liability? Let me give you this last tip. See, everybody loves using Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, TikToks, all these things, right? All these services are free, right? They're free to you and me. When something is free, typically... It's because it's using you and you're not using it. And they're using you to get distracted, to sell you something, to get in your head, and to put you behind. So I hope this helps you get more clarity in your distractions. I wish you nothing but health, wealth, success, but most importantly, freedom. Thanks, guys.